care for shows. My baby don't care for clothes. Hi everyone, it's Kim from Front Row Hair here today. In today's hair tutorial on how to curl your hair, I'm going to be using a new product. Um, well, it's not a new product, I just recently found it and I absolutely love these hot tools. It's a brand called Vaudry and um, the product I'm using today is called the My Curl Curling Wand. So, um, just a little bit of um, information on the product. As you can see, it has this conical shape and the reason for that is so that you can create bigger curls if you wrap your hair around the sort of fatter part and then the thin part is if you want to create a more tight curl. Um, this is also for different lengths of hair so if you have long hair you want to wrap your hair around the big part and if you have short hair um, it won't really wrap around the big part so you can use the smaller area. Now this particular uh, styling iron is made from a precious gemstone called tourmaline and um, what tourmaline actually does for your hair is it locks in the moisture when you're using the, the curling wand, which is completely different from what we're used to when it comes to heat styling. It also gives your hair shine and really retains the integrity of the hair. Um, so I also absolutely love using this because it creates a beautiful curl. Um, I'll show you, I actually curled my hair extensions already. And as you can see, it's a beautiful spiral curl like that. Um, I haven't combed this out yet, but uh, we'll do that once we've put them in our hair. We'll see um, how much brushing out of the curls we want to do. But it creates a perfect curl. And I know for a lot of girls who struggle to curl their hair and they end up with like funny looking curls, this particular curling wand is extremely easy to use. So I definitely recommend it. Okay, so um, I haven't managed to find a hair clip anywhere in my house today. I'm sure you've all experienced those times where you just can't find one hair clip anywhere. So I'll be using a hair elastic to section my hair off today. Um, and for today's curl, I really want to use small sections of hair. So we're even looking at um, widths of like one and a half to two centimeters. Um, so we grab a very small section of hair, okay, maybe two centimeters. And I'm, as I say, I'm creating a tight curl, so I'm going to do it kind of towards the end of the curling wand. And I'm curling it from the root. This is the nice thing about um, conical shaped curling wands without the little clamp, um, is that you can curl your hair right kind of against the root. And the other thing is you don't get those funny little kinks that you sometimes see on the hair. So that's the curl that we've created. Now when you're curling your hair, a little piece of information, just until you get to the top. You want to curl your hair by first putting the wand underneath. Okay, so you put the wand underneath and you do one curl underneath. And then when you do your next curl, you actually put the curling wand on top of the hair. So you would take it and put it on top and curl it upwards. Okay, and the reason we do this is because we create more naturally looking effect. Um, we want, you know, we want the curls to all kind of face in different directions. When people have curly hair, their curls never all fall the same way. So um, by doing this, we really create a more natural looking how to do the front. Okay, so we're still grabbing small sections of hair. Okay, and we're curling the hair away from our face. So just make sure when you're wrapping the hair around that you're wrapping it away from your face. My baby just cares for me Oh, my baby don't care for The cousin races My baby don't care for I don't place it Oh, well, this tail is not his style Okay, so now we're going to do the other side at the top and I know everyone always struggles with which hand 
to use when they're curling the other side of their hair because you have to curl the hair away from your face and um, I'm going to show you how to hold the curling iron so this will really help you when you're curling the, your right side or your left side depending on um, if you're right or left handed so we grab a little piece and now we're going to hold the curling iron in the other hand and turn it upside down like this and wrap the hair around. So it's actually really, really easy to curl the other side of your head as well. So we're swapping our curling wand into the other hand again. And as you can see, these are beautiful, beautiful spiral curls. I really think this curling one is amazing. So what I'm going to do now is, um, I've already curled my extensions. I'll show you a little clip of how I did that. clipping in my extensions. I used four of our front row quad wefts. Um, two of them were the chestnut ombre and then two dark brown. Um, and I absolutely love this curl. It's not something I usually wear so it really does feel very different. Um, but I'm not going to brush them out. I'm actually just going to leave them uh, as they are. And um, yeah, so I'm really happy with this product. I think the curls are absolutely stunning. Obviously, if you want to, you can go right ahead and brush the curls out. Um, as you brush them, you'll see the curls get longer and longer and your hair will look a little bit longer. Um, yeah, so I hope this tutorial has been helpful for you and uh, you will try this at home. Also, if you can, give the Vaudry My Curl um, a try as well. It's a really great product. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye. So I've finished clipping. I've finished clipping. Finished clipping.